Hey guys, how's it going? Kriparian here. Today I want to give you guys a fun Wisdom Ball game that I had. Wisdom Ball is always one of those quests that I hesitate to pick because, well, the results are just a little bit too mixed. Most of the time you're going to get very weak options to no help at all, but sometimes you get a fair bit of help, and I've noticed that there are a few kind of trends to the Wisdom Ball. One major one being that one of the things that the Wisdom Ball likes to do, among the many options that it has, is to give you boards full of neutral minions. And that has some pretty stark um, meanings when it comes to you might be searching for a few specific neutral minions to beat the lobby. Well, Wisdom Ball, while it might not, uh, you know, AI itself into giving you exactly what you need, Sometimes, you can make it work the other way around. Take a look. Let's do a Maya run. It is uh, raining outside, so there's like dripping sounds and stuff because the snow is still I melting. That's why Dex is a little now bit, a little bit of a worker today. Not a lot we could do about that right now. Yeah, I, I guess that's okay. Will I play Ruthless if it doesn't have the new leak mechanic? Wow, that's a curveball. Um, that would be crazy to me. Uh, it would depend on how much of a meta shakeup we're getting this this patch and what the new league mechanic actually is. Um, I knew you could do it. If I am right, I believe that the holiday POE patch is the big one of the year. You're unstoppable. Channel point red is messed up and it's orange. It's red, but I have the um, I the opacity. Do it. Uh, I have the opacity pretty uh, pretty uh, low. Need a drink? Actually, don't really like any of this. Ooh, four years. Thank you, High Rento. Sleepy doggo. Sleepy. Sleepy. Keep it up, your minions are dependent on you. Oh, that was bad though. I think the sack is pretty good, but I think the Wisdom Ball is going to... So one thing that Wisdom Ball does is refresh neutrals. Only neutrals. So Wisdom Ball actually is quite strong in getting your first brand. And it can give you the random Divine Shield on your minions one. So both of those are really good for Murlocs. My favorite hero. I think I still like Denathrius the most, just being able to get two quests. Um, I like most heroes that can get um, uh, Sinstone, just because the Sinstone gameplay is just such a high level of craziness. Guardians, prepare your magic. Yeah, like twenty-five percent. to fight by your side. The shop is growing stronger with you. Uh, her stone expansions are always two states. It's the, it's the, not, not the, this Tuesday, it's one Tuesday after that. I think.
Okay, that's pretty good. Good luck out there. I believe in you. Deserve better. Here, have a go. Okay. This one will almost certainly lose, but being at 31 health doesn't matter how badly we lose it. Damage cap will save. And then next turn we should be able to get that completed, but probably won't be able to get much out of it. Don't give up. With the power of love, there's no way you can lose. Yeah, not too bad. Watch me, made you want to try Pee Wee. Tips for a first timer. You have to be strong, even in the I think face the, um, the classes that are tanky and have high regen are really beginner friendly. No reason to keep that, so... So that should happen before the roll. Oh, I had the elemental, whoops. turn but we get an actual free level up next turn so that's pretty good um i think righteous fire is like a little bit complicated but there are other powerful like inquisitor builds juggernaut builds like in calandra inquisitor oh, spark okay. i guess spark inquisitor i would maybe try that i think that's a powerful yet simple build I already read the Curse Manifesto. The details are too important to make any judgments right now. But I know you can handle it. You're my angel investor. You want that? Can't really support it yet. I can take that one in. Here's a gold for it. There is so much power in this one. Now tame it. This is no place for Marco. I mean, I, I think I probably lose, but I'm hoping not to die. Nice. 
Request rejected. You were great in that battle. A third minion for your triple. Cannot do that right now. Why do I have to play first place, dude? It's really not that bad, but... Yeah, these matchups are concerning more than anything. Because you can't get damage, multi curse, and profane bloom anymore. to join our team. Okay. Eh. What? much stronger than before. Taste defeat. Wow, they actually have the same stats. That's kind of cool.
upgrades for Baron. I kind of want free rerolls. Selfless Baron is pretty good. We typically want like golden selfless before you buy the Baron. And because I have the Wisdom Ball, I just want the quantity of rerolls. Especially with a triple brand. Hoping for a shield. Success? A third minion for your it's trip. Good there is so much power in this one. Now tame it. for a spot of tea. I should have used the Uther. Does it matter? No. Yeah, both of those will get poisoned. I don't want the small one first because he has a small taunt. I guess it's not really that small. Oh no. Well, don't let it get you down. For justice. Nothing scares me except mine. Why, of course, I can take that one in. Here's a gold for it. Leroy Jenkins. Yeah, that's still quite good, I'd say. Selfless could hit me, right? Yeah, 
Powerful minion on the field, but it's brave. That a mistake. Good board. I'll keep them safe for you. Cell three. Uh, I don't know about that, man. I think cell three might not end super well. During Dark Moon, turn 12 Enders. I mean, there's still a lot of those. My full name is Tuxedo Magic, Crystal Man of Mystery. But you can call me Hothra Bob. Oh, he left. Sure. Nice. 